right now, just 20 minutes into the hunt. There's already some shiny up there, too far to understand what they are, but now we try and get closer and see. So we got to find that chamois, it was in fact very nice, nice male, beautiful scene but I think not too old so uh, here we have really a lot of animals and we have the chance to keep going and finding really the right ones, so be very selective. That's a bit the beauty of the chamois hunt, especially in these places and especially in this season when uh, during the rut the males run a lot around. It's really active, it's exciting, it's a continuous excitement through the day. Uh, I think that's why this is my favorite hunt. Very typical Italian pocket lunch. approach everything works perfectly but then it just disappears it, it, ha it happens Chamois hunting is by far my favorite hunt in Italy. Hunting chamois is really about the experience. Look at today. This morning we could have shot, after 20 minutes into the hunt, we could have shot a very nice male, good trophy, uh, that seemed a bit young. And it was very early and, and we decided not to take the shot because it was not old enough and because it was very early in the day. This decision allowed us to spend an incredibly nice day. We spent uh, the whole day in one of the nicest natural environments in Italy. Uh, we saw ibexes and at the end of the day we even got the reward of shooting a 13 or 14 year old male with a broken horn. Doesn't matter. It's just the perfect trophy to close such a day. Uh, then you come back and you're in Italy in a place like this uh, with great food, wine, so what else would you like? 
I would say if you like mountain hunting, that might be very challenging in certain situations and in certain areas, but in other might be much easier with areas in the mountains that are much more easy to access. Uh, but regardless of this, if you like spending time in the mountains, if you like seeing many animals and being active in stalking them, uh, well, this is the hunt for you.